Hello everyone, a warm welcome to the Champions Planet round of 16 draw for 2024. Now this uh, this year has been an incredible year for Champions League football so far and we wanted to spice it up by bringing in loads of games with custom players and really spice up the Champions League and make it very exciting for, on the Westy TV channel. That's not quite happened what we thought we would be expecting, pretty much. Um, we, we only managed to get one match day out and that was match day one. But uh, you all seem to really, really enjoy it on the channel here. So what we're going to be doing is um, continuing it with a round of 16 with some spicy ties um, and draw doing a draw here today. So uh, to explain what you've missed over the past kind of three, four months, I've simmed all the games uh, off camera and I have made sure that all the custom players were involved in the games and this is who was uh, through and who didn't get through in the end. So Bayern Munich were top of Group A. They won with 15 points after their law, despite their loss to Manchester United in the first fixture. Manchester United did come second but had to scrape through against Galatasaray in the last fixture. Arsenal took on RC Lens for the battle of top spot in Group B on the final match day. And unfortunately uh, for RC Lens, they didn't get top spot and Arsenal did win their group. Uh, Real Madrid and Marseille went through in Group C, Francois Collu's side shocking Napoli on the last day to progress through to the knockout stages. Inter Milan took on Benfica for the top spot on the final match day, Group D, they both went through in the end. Club Atletico de Madrid and Celtic went through in Group E, Paris Saint-Germain and Borussia Dortmund knocked out Newcastle and AC Milan in Group F. Manchester City and Rangers, Rangers being the huge shock of the season in the Champions League, but not as big as a shock as Royal Antwerp, who finished runners-up to Barcelona in Group H. And also Manchester City, the holders, were won their group in Group G. So, to kind of sum it all up, um, today I have got the unseeded teams in this one. They're going to be drawn first all the time, uh, as they will have home advantage in the first leg. They will then be drawn uh, but there will then be a seeded team drawn. Country protection is in effect in this draw, similar to how the group stage draw would work. Once that, uh, once these fixtures have been played, we're going to do a quarter-final draw when there's no country protection and everyone is out of free for all, basically. So to explain it, then uh, unseeded for unseeded first, seeded second. If there is a clash of countries, that team drawn will move down to the next fixture, and then we will draw and fill the gaps in between. So, it's not like a way for draw, but this is how SDTV does it. So we're gonna roll with it. So, to start off with the unseeded sides. Got one here. The first unseeded side is SL Benfica. So Benfica, I believe a quarter finalist last season. They have had a, well, a very good run so far in this, uh, in this Champions League season. I think they can be count themselves as very impressive. They will be facing them. And another thing to mention as well, teams who have played in the same group cannot play each other again uh, until the quarterfinals. So let's see who the next team is. And it is Paris Saint-Germain. Paris Saint-Germain. Um, well, I think they've faced Benfica before, but not for a long time. So that will be a tie to look out for. Look out for Kylian Mbappe on his... Uh, Quest for a Champions League, he's had a World Cup and a lot of league and titles in domestic. And he round off one last season with PSG before he maybe goes off to Real Madrid. But the next team drawn from the unseeded is Rangers of Glasgow. Glasgow Rangers. Fiery time with Celtic back in the Champions League after a while out. Europa League finalists in 2022. And Rangers will be facing Club Atletico de Madrid. The Edgar Simeone's team, finalists in 2016 and 2014 as well, losing out to Real Madrid both times. The next unseeded team, Olympique de Marseille. Marseille are well, captained by Francois Collu and have been a real joy to watch in the Champions League this season, beating Napoli on the final match day. And Marseille will be facing FC Barcelona, FC Barcelona of uh, Spain, up against Xavi's side. He's 
really quite enjoyed his time by Xavi, one league title and hopefully many more before he leaves at the end of the season. Next from the unseeded sides, Celtic Football Club, Celtic haven't reached the round of 16 for some time. So a pleasure for the green and uh, green and white of the uh, side of Glasgow. And the next from the seeded box is Manchester City. Manchester City, the treble holders and the treble winners from last season. So they're winning 1-0 in, uh, in Ataturk. Last summer. And the next from the unseeded sides is the other half of Manchester. It's Manchester United. Manchester United. Huge sleeping giant of the Champions League. Three, three wins in their, in their history 1968, 2008, and 1999, the famous treble win. And coming out of the pot for Manchester United, it's Arsenal, but Arsenal cannot play Manchester United just yet. They will be moved down to the next available slots to face an unseeded side so we draw again sorry from the seeded teams Manchester United cannot face Bayern so it's Real Madrid or Inter Milan for the Red Devils it's FC Bayern so FC Bayern this is gonna look a bit weird for you some of you at home so uh, they can't face Arsenal because they were a seeded side. They can't face Manchester United because they're in the same group. So it's starting to take shape. Hopefully the graphic on screen will help you guys a bit. But we will continue with the seeded sides. See who we can get out, out of here. And it's FC Internazionale Milano for Manchester United into Milan. Side they know well in the past. I think a side they will breathe a sigh of relief. So the next unseeded side is Borussia Dortmund who will take on Arsenal. A side that uh, well acquired Joe Mulligan in the summer and I think will be very pleased. Well, he's one. Oh, hang on. I've got to go for unseeded. Hang on. That's uh, going to screw up the draw a bit. So the last unseeded for to face Bayern Munich is R.C. Law. R.C. Law. Which means there is one tie and uh, one tie remaining. And it is Royal Antwerp who come out of the hat next. And the one last team just for the sake of the draw is Real Madrid CF. Real Madrid, 14 time champions, success in the past decade, winners in 2022. And well, that completes the draw then for the Champions Planet to round of 16. So to run down through the ties we have Benfica against Paris Saint-Germain, Rangers versus Club Atletico de Madrid, Marseille take on Barcelona, Celtic take on Manchester City, Manchester United take on Inter Milan, Borussia Dortmund take on Arsenal, Arsenal take on Bayern Munich, Real Madrid take on Royal Antwerp and that is the conclusion of the draw. Um, I need to go find my coke in a minute, I've left, left my coke somewhere and I mean the diet coke not other stuff but anyway um thank you all very much for watching the ties will come out uh one by one over the next few weeks we're gonna have a gap of so we'll do one break day and have a one um, and they will come out between the next over the next 30 days so we look forward to seeing uh seeing you watch these incredible fixtures and we look forward to seeing you very very soon so thank you all very much for watching see you next time and goodbye <laughs>